Hi, I'm Shazad. Today, as I'm recording this, it's International Human Rights Day, and I want to talk to you about a specific cause that I feel very strongly about that I would love your support with. Uh, specifically, I'm talking about a refugee camp on the island of Samos. It's a place I worked for a month, about a year ago, uh, that is in desperate need uh, for more humanitarian aid right now. The refugee situation in Europe has largely fallen out of the headlines now, but it's still just as bad as it was in previous years. I spent a month volunteering in this camp with refugees from Syria, Afghanistan, Iraq, Iran, Eritrea, Somalia, Bangladesh, and Pakistan. The camp itself is basically on an idyllic island, but it's like an open-air prison for families. People are living in tents and in shipping containers for months at a time. It is definitely terrible. I feel like the EU is struggling to meet its humanitarian responsibilities, so NGOs like the Boat Refugee Foundation, which I worked for, and Samos Volunteers, which is still on the island, have stepped in to be a major actor in the response to the crisis. Right now, this camp has about 2,000 people who are not prepared for winter. So I'm working with volunteers to raise money for two specific things. One is for shipping winter clothes and winter gear from the Netherlands, from a coat drive that's happened, and shipping them via freight to this island of Samos. And the second is medical supplies, specifically medicines and stuff like bandages. There's been a sort of change off in the medical actors working on that island. And so right now they're dangerously low on a lot of the basic supplies. So what I'm looking to do is basically help with shipping uh, medicines from elsewhere in the world um, and then say buying some as needed in Greece locally. I know the people who are working on these projects, uh, the people in the Netherlands are former volunteers of the group I worked with. And I can tell you that they'd be this money would go towards a very specific cause. And any money I raise in excess of probably about 2,000-ish dollars will go towards Samos Volunteers. Samos Volunteers is a group I worked alongside with. We started off basically providing basic supplies for people first get to the island, stuff like a change of clothes, sandals, underwear, and that kind of kit costs about $12 to provide to a refugee. Now Samos Volunteers does that and also uh, provides educational classes in English, Greek, French, German, places where people might go, potentially, if, if they get asylum. It's a really, really amazing NGO also operating there. In this campaign, uh, I have a goal of $2,000 I'm going to set. I made a short film with refugee students that I had taught a videography class to last year. It's a film the refugee students shot. They interviewed each other for it. I helped them with editing. My friend Yusuf helped with the scoring. It's a three-minute film that I think is quite evocative, and unlike most things, it's refugee voices and, and viewpoints laid bare in on the screen. Anyone who donates to this will get a link to this video immediately. And then when we hit our funding milestone, I'll release that publicly. I think it'll be something that, you know, some people will find emotional. I'm planning to do like a little mini screening in New York as well. I appreciate any help you have. I'm open to sort of any questions. I try to be as transparent as I can about this stuff. People want to know where the money goes. I'll tell you, none of the money goes to me. If there are any fees in, in any part of this process, I will eat those. What I'm looking for is I just want people to sort of think about this crisis, act whether it's financially or whether it's through advocacy, I think it's really important and it shouldn't fall out of our radar. It means a lot to help strangers you may probably never meet. Anyway, thank you very much from the bottom of my heart.